All right, so the last run could have gone better. Let's let's bring it back, okay? Let's um, you know, two birds in the hand is worth more than one in the bush. I've always said this. And then we get two pill bugs, but I'm like, man, is two pill bugs better than a bird? I can't help but notice as we play as perhaps maybe the vague fungi. Um, we uh, didn't do well last time. And we had uh, pill bugs on every single run. Do you think there could possibly be some relevance to that? We roll everything to look for... No. We, we take two pill bugs. We make sure we're buffing a bird. Even though the squad's uh, order is horrible. Um, it's a very interesting setup here. A bird that buffs a pill bug. I think we draw, honestly. And, that, and that's very positive given the where we were at about five seconds ago. I think we lose. <laughs> In fact, I know we lose. <laughs> I was so confident before I saw who my opponent was and that they had purchased some animals. Um, this is good though, okay? We level. Leveling's always positive. We get a, a leech every single time, which is not positive for the record. We buy and sell. There is a part of me that thinks um, as, as we, are we, no, we're not gonna buy and sell and then get a leech, come on. Um, give me one of these. Give me one of these. We probably will level you next time. What the heck? Why well, you got it? The whole shop is frozen. But it's not like they're gonna give me anything better than this anyway. All the tier twos make me want to die. Um, am I crazy, or did we just become best friends? Are we doing well now? We could save um, the mouse level up, but I, I don't think it's necessary. Like, just give me this for now. I Forget the capybara. You had your dang chance. Roll me once. There's not much of a point to, like, putting another kiwi on top. I'm not really willing to sell the, uh, like, to combine the birds. I guess I'd be willing to sell a 4-4 mouse that basically just exists to become apples. Um, and then buy? And this is a strange one. Roll me... You could probably freeze a shrimp to facilitate some combined shenanigans. So it, it, this whole squad is... And the reason I didn't move my order here is because I don't want to buff a kiwi because they're going to get sold. I understand we're buffing two birds and really both of them can't really benefit from the buff. But, I mean, you got to cut me some slack here. Nobody's perfect, right? <laughs> by the way, we will lose this one. Not, not by much, just by a zombie cricket. That's, you know, you don't have to blow up the whole team just because you lose game six. We got to think about how we're going to do this. And I'm thinking. Because I would have liked to have leveled you, but I guess with, with the position we're in right now, we would just do that. It's hard for me to invest in, like, the birds to be combined on turn five. We need more. I almost, with, with God as my witness, I kind of think you have to try the starfish gambit. I don't think the starfish is that good. It, it can shine in some weeklies, but I think there's... If there's ever a time, it's turn five. because Or, or earlier, like on turn three, if you get it on level up. Because then we, we you all those tier one units, like half of them benefit from a cell. So I think a toad is good enough, but I'm going to roll in favor of finding more units that sell well and hoping that we don't buff the wrong birds over and over, but anything can, oh, wait, hold on, you're a cell trigger, don't be a fool. And then I didn't even really think about this, but it, it is true, like a, a cassowary is part of a strawberry build and we are kind of on a strawberry trajectory still. We're, we're straddling a few different archetypes, but I, I the, the strangest thing just happened. I felt some confidence return to me. I, I feel like I, I gained some self-worth there. So we're looking for cell triggers. But we're also, like, the cassowary leveling would be nice. You're not cell triggers, which is not uncommon. <laughs> the, the, the cell triggers don't seem to be very uh, common past tier one. We have some buy triggers. That's not really that valuable, though. Those are some good cell triggers. You knew I'd like those cell triggers. Okay, so freeze you. I'm holding the cassowary, like, or the, the cucumber, just in case we can get the cassowary to grab it, but we probably have other priorities here. I, I feel like the starfish, 
I don't know. It's like the, the biggest enigma in the whole pack. And we, we will lose this one, just to be clear. Um, because it takes up a spot, but it is kind of the scaler that we're looking for. Or maybe I'm overemphasizing how important the scaler is here, because we don't actually necessarily... And, and I'm going for broke here. <laughs> we don't necessarily need a scaler as much in the default pack as we do in the weekly, I think, but... Okay, we, I mean, I guess, sure, you know what? You've created such an interesting scenario. Why, why wouldn't I try to meet you on your own terms, right? And, and out of all these, so you're at three, three, one, one, one. Okay, well, sell the duck. Don't buff the beaver. Sell the beaver. And now buy a lion. And, like, at least it's something, right? Like, it's not great. You're going to be a like a 9-10, I think. You're going to be a 9-9 nine, because nine you got shot once? I, I feel like we made the right decision. To go four squad is scary, but not as scary as losing. And now I'm like, dude, we have a, we have a, a real scaler. Like, you give us 3-4 for two gold. You just can't run with a tier 5 or greater, so remember that. Now, we're looking for sellables. We don't see them. That's okay. I think cheese has some value. Although, man, it's taken away the potential of buy sells. Are we really going to dump a cassowary <laughs> to facilitate this? It's one of those things where I'm like, you can't, but you got to. You know, like, because this is... It, they forced us to choose an archetype, and, and for that, I'll always respect them. But uh, it, it, it brings me some pain. I guess we don't have to sell a beaver. We could always just buy an anteater. You don't have to sell a beaver. And you're still a tier 5, so this is fine. And you're a sell trigger. Okay. Um, I don't know. Like, time will tell if this is better or worse or, you know, what. And our pill bug's probably not in the right position. But I do feel like... Again, I, I know I said this last episode and we lost, so it seems like it's invalid. But sometimes I think like a bad strategy you can stick to is certainly better than a good like the optimal strategy that's impossible to adhere to. And I kind of feel like that's where we're at right now. Like this strategy is very easy to adhere to because it's fun. Not interested. We need cell triggers. I don't want a pill bug. I do appreciate the offer. I never wanted to seem like I don't appreciate the offer. We really just want to buy cell triggers. You're a you're a cell trigger. You're not like anything for us, really. Although I will say, hold on, this is now I'm like we're we're spoiled for choice. We can't run the zebra. We can run the crow. Why can't we run the zebra? I don't think you need me to tell you that, but in case you're as dumb as I am right now. Um, the crow is a level 4, the lion's a level 5, or tier 5, and the lion can only operate, really, with any kind of efficiency when it's the highest level, the highest tier unit on the squad. So, we, we can't run the zebra right now, but we will sell the crow, probably feed the lion the chocolate, because lions apparently like chocolate. It's bad for most animals, but as long as we don't finish with the zebra here, it's okay. And notice I didn't say finish on the zebra, that's because I've been on the internet too long to be trapped like that. So... Give me one of these. Nice buff. Sell me. How the heck did we end up with a 30-40 pill bug? I don't know. Life comes at you fast. Even our lion is really strong right now. We don't really have buy cells here. But we have to take something. It can't be the husky. You know what? Why don't you try me? Uh, it can't be the triceratops either. Why don't you try me with a little bit of uh, donkey action? You can trap me in that one, apparently. Something's gone wrong. Um, because I feel like we are much stronger than most of the teams we go up against, and that doesn't make sense. Because I feel like we had nothing going for us, but we are at six wins. It, it could change in a heartbeat. Let's not get overconfident. So I, I feel like I, I had you many times and chose not to buy-sell you for some reason. Maybe that's my, my mind playing tricks on me. You're already, like, you're leveling enough. You're almost at max. I think we kind of buffed the, the starfish right now, as crazy as it sounds. Now, this is... I wish that we could find a way to make you work. We could sell the anteater. You know what? We're gonna. It's only a 510. 
we almost make up the stats just from the starfish, not even looking at the other animals involved here. Roll me. We have any cell triggers in here? We do. That's useful. I think you have to buy, sell. We're gonna four squad this, and and I think it's worth it. We can't take you. I would love to. Wow, you know what? <laughs> we could take you. You just have to think, because the problem is that it ruins the lion, okay? And well, it, by ruins, it, I mean instead of a 50-50, it's a 34-39, so you're losing 16-11. But by buying this, we'd be generating another 32-43, which seems better than buying like another animal in here. So you know what? Because it gives coconut armor to the pill bug. I think, it's, I think it's worth a shot, as bizarre as this seems. What the heck is this? You can call me crazy. I think this seems totally fine. This was not scary. I went up against myself, basically, from, from a zanier time. Um, now, I think I think you can stay, because I think the lion's going to get there anyway. Rather than think of it like, oh, the lion uh, is not getting the benefit of this, the way I would choose to think about this, I guess, is that the lion, it got an, it, it, it pulled its own ability forward. You know, it, it pre-bought its stats. No, it, the opposite. The, the, now, he, bear with me here. The Lion is Electronics Boutique, and the game pre-ordered itself, so the Lion got the money early for the product it was going to sell you in six months. And now that it's got the money and you got the product, we don't say, oh, no fair. We say, hey, we're square. And it rhymes, so it must be right. In that case, we're opened up to possibly being able to take a Stegosaurus. It's a 12-12 buff. We would probably look at that as being considerably more useful than the buffs we're getting out of a starfish right now. That seems sensible to me. Everything I just said seems to track. And yet, now I'm like, okay, I know we could get a level 2, but we don't really need a level 2. Instead, we could just get this, sell it, get a 2-2-2-2. Two, 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 two. There's your 2-2-2-2, two, 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 and then get the benefit anyway. So you're getting slightly, you know, you should just be there. No, it should just be here. Okay. You're getting slightly overkilled on HP. Who cares? It doesn't matter. It's still the right way to, to set it up. I don't know if we're going to be fine. Um, but I don't feel too bad. Okay, I feel fine. That's eight. This has been a fun one. I've had a good time. Uh... Now I think you just ride it. I think you you buy some foods, maybe, if you can. I do think um, if you get a strawberry on the roll, which we didn't, but if we did, I mean, it's tough. Would we rather have a 10-10 starfish or would we rather give 13-13 to another unit? Well... We don't really need to give 13, 13 to you. We really need to give like 12, 3. 12, 3 is less than 10, 10. But I, 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 look, it's not easy. For now, I think we like this. We don't care about the lion. We're, we're almost fishing. Okay. I don't know if we're going to live for that matter. But uh, we're almost fishing for another strawberry. And then a level 2. Um, if, if we live. And I'm, I'm overthinking this. But... Um, I'm, I'm looking for, like, another strawberry or a, uh... Well, that's really it. We could, it, with another strawberry, we could justify selling the 1010 starfish, putting a strawberry on our lion, and running two level one velociraptors and hoping for the best, but... We, we, well, it's academic right now. I would still say you take the level... And, uh, I mean, a level 2 starfish doesn't do much for us right now, to be fair. I still think... Like, here's the thing. People will, like, they'll talk your ear off about, well, you're wasting some of the stats that come from the Stegosaurus. Yeah, but, like, you know, giving 14-14 to your big unit is better than giving it to your small unit a lot of the time because it has more HP. So it gets to make better use of the attack that might be overkill or, or vice versa. You know, sometimes it's better to have, like, a 50-50 a that could have been, like, a 55-55 than it is to turn your 10-10 into a 25-25 a that dies in one hit anyway. Anyway, I must be right because I won, so that's 10 wins somehow. That was, a, like, the best pivot I've ever had in my life. 
Uh, and this is the worst shop I've ever seen. So that's, we're not very well rewarded. Can I try something insane? Here's, here's the insanity play, okay? Be a, there's a lot of good ones here. How about a cheesy wig? Like a Green Bay Packers fan. This team cannot win round one, by the way. If we play a full squad, it, even if we play a two squad, it's going to lose. But um, I think um, what, I, what I like about this is that we're one strawberry away from greatness. Well, well, well. And if you'll allow me here... This is, a, this is a very strange dilemma. Do we really... No, we're not going to buff a bird. We're going to create a super duck. How about that? Rather than waste a 2-2 buff from a bird. Um, we're creating a situation where we could... And maybe that's the operative kind of phrasing here. We could get a starfish and kickstart the exact same team we just ran. I don't think any the, anyone would call us lucky if we got a starfish. It's... Not really considered that good of an animal, and yet, hold on, hold on, <laughs> buy me, sell me, <clears throat> and we're going to keep you around, as weird as that sounds, too, because we got some sell triggers, but um, we're never going to buff you, like, we're just going to keep you around, and we're going to do a little buy and a little sell, and I guess for now, we might as well add you and, and add you, um, you're, just, you're just a vessel, you're just a conduit. You're, you know, the you're the gatekeeper and you're the key master. Take your pick. We're going to draw. It's a painful draw, but I think it's the kind of pain you need to go through in order to experience um, greatness later, hopefully. Like, um, sell me. Don't buff this. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I mean, you couldn't have done it any different, I guess, but then sell me. I feel like this can work. As crazy as it sounds, you're going to sell me. You're going to buy me and sell me? I don't really care if you hit the hummingbird, by the way. That's like the hummingbird deserves it. It's, it's helping us out here. Um, we'll, we'll run a four squad or less. It doesn't bother me. It doesn't just have to be a sell trigger. Like, it could be just worthwhile in its own right. We don't have to sell you this turn. We don't even have to buy you this turn. This looks bad, but like a, a 15... Is that? A, I thought they buffed, or sorry, nerfed the, the bird or the the hummingbird. But because for once we have to be specific, because we got a little duck too. Mm, we draw these. It hurts, but it's okay. Um, I I think one double digit strength unit is is good enough here, more than good enough, quite frankly. And like the cell triggers just keep coming. Maybe this is too much, but I I kind of like that our squad is like light on units because it means that we're buffing only units that we want to keep around although there might be a little self-fulfilling prophecy associated with that a lot of people will tell you that's when you pivot to cassowary for all i know they may be right i may be crazy but here's the thing if you're watching this video i might just be the lunatic you're looking for billy joel madison square garden what night every night i think I don't know how COVID affected those hours. Either way, you're going to sell me. You're going to buy me. You're going to sell me. It's a weird team. You're going to buy me. Now, I want to add a bird, but I don't want the bird to get affected by the cell triggers that could come from the starfish, right? So, like, I have to... I'd rather buy the bird last, although I don't know necessarily if this is going to really pay dividends for us. Um, I'll buy the bird now, and then we can combine it next turn. I still think like a 25-30, which is basically what we're going to have here, 26-28, it's good enough. It, in fact, it's more than good enough. It should solo most teams. I'm stunned that our win count is as low as it is. Even You, you can say we only have one good unit. Yeah, but it's really good. <laughs> I think we can invest in you. I know that's a little insanity in and of itself. You're not sellables. You're a sellable, which means we have to start the combination, unfortunately. We don't need to run a full squad. We don't even need to run a four squad. I'm, I'm suggesting this. This is my null hypothesis. My null hypothesis is that a three squad 
maybe not this three squad, but a three squad could work. And by the way, this three squad can work. I'm in the I'm in the lab. I'm coming up with things you ain't ever seen before. And look at this. We got more space than I've ever seen before. There's there's a grandfather paradox in here that shouldn't be plausible, but as long as you don't buff the beaver here, it's okay. I'm going to become the Joker. I'm going to show you. I'll show all of you. I'll become the Joker. That's a buy sell. Is if I've ever seen one, that's a buy sell. Let's be honest. You need it more than anybody. This is beautiful. It's the greatest thing I've ever seen. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I think we buy you. Um, sure, let's buy you to save some money next time. And then we'll buy the starfish early. Oh, you, that was a sell trigger. It, it's nonstop. It, everything's a sell trigger. The whole world is sell triggers right now. You just got to know where to look. Am I insane? I seem to recall uh, when this pack came out, I said something like, is it possible the starfish has no home? It does nothing. It's the worst animal in the game. Recently, I did put out a video. Is the starfish the most underrated animal in the pack? I'm going to tell you something. A little trade secret, if you will. I uh, Basically, we just did well with the starfish, so I put the cart before the horse. It's an inversion of the way that causality should work, and I apologize for that. But I, I, I felt it at the time, but I'm feeling it much more now. Sell me. No grandfather paradox, please. Thank you. And then a little sell me. And then a little buy me. And rather than have a 2-3, let's generate more stats, dead than alive. Um, roll me. No sellables. No sellables. Pardon me. We'll put a bird at the front here. Or in the middle. But on the squad is what I meant to say. We're, we're running into an interesting situation. And I, I've been very vocal... Sometimes I do think people concern themselves more with, like, mathematical perfection than result. They optimize for, like, not making a mistake in the shop rather than getting results in the, in the rounds. But we are going to probably overbuff this duckling, which is funny to say given the circumstances. Um, and the circumstances are that we've deliberately sold off about, you know, 10 levels up for it. But that's okay. Um... I think we can we can consider that acceptable. We would maybe just be like, you know what? Maybe like a 4-2 buff is not as valuable anymore as just a green pepper. I, a green pepper on a high HP unit is not that relevant though either. I'm kind of just flabbergasted that it keeps working. <laughs> I'm expecting like, you know, any moment now to reach the point where I'm like, oh, we didn't just narrowly eke out a victory, we got blown out. But instead, we keep, like, winning quite nicely, and I'm feeling like a like a champ, man. Although this is a draw, but, you know, it's a sample size of one. We can't say that it's all coming down. What we can say is, you know, maybe give me a little buy-sell. It's around 11. Give me a little tier 6. I just like what happens to you when you get buffed. I think you can become a very fun unit. So I'm going to add you for a moment, and wouldn't you know it. <laughs> okay. Um, so we're going to buy you for a second here. I don't... I think we're in, a, we're in the driver's seat. That's the way I would describe this. I am on the verge of saying something I would have thought insane merely moments ago. Is it possible a starfish on tier 3 is the best unit you could ever get? I sort of can't believe I'm saying it, and yet here we are. Um, I don't know what to invest in, man. I guess we'll chocolate this uh, this saber tooth and, and try to make it tick. We're looking for buy cells. Come on. Come on you, oh, I, I do appreciate it. I don't want to sound like I don't appreciate it. That's fine. I, that was a very jarring sound effect. I don't know if anybody else was as shocked by it as I was. I told you we were in the lab. I don't know. And this is... We're, we're, I think we're maybe going to lose here. But this is... We're definitely going to lose. I was just about to say, I don't know if I'm going to know what it feels like to lose again. Like, I'm going to... I'm so shocked that I'm... I don't know what to say. I'm flabbergasted. I'm, I'm blown away. 
it seems like the game is broken. How, how could I face um, strife after such an unmitigated period of relative decadence? I don't know. Maybe this is the calm before the storm. Maybe we're going down. But if we are, I promise, we're going down swinging, and I'll be a loaded god complex cock it and pull it. Only just now realizing it doesn't really rhyme. Before attack, gain melon. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. You're a buy cell. Delightful. I, I'm really trying to get like the saber tooth to pop. I know, by the way, we could sell the bird now because we're not really making use of the benefit from our uh, from the strawberry. But like, the bird is a twenty-five, twenty-five, or whatever. Like, it's not getting sold. <laughs> Any unit that's stuck around this long is is sticking around till the end because we're almost there. Now we're not taking a level uh, a level two vulture, which is a rarity for me to say skip it on that. But excuse me, can you buff our saber tooth, please? I know you guys have like a rapport or whatever, but like we're trying to get new units involved with the squad as well. That, okay, that that's fine. I'll take it. I'm not upset. Um, we'll pass on this one. I don't really think the Sabretooth is that great, but I do think if they have Mosquitoes and Vultures, then it can go pretty hard. Now they have a Mosquito, it somehow missed me. Which is maybe a benefit, because we get to keep our Green Pepper. This hurts. This hurts me. We, we can't win this. Although, actually, okay, we can do some damage, because I was just going to say we're going to break your melon, but we're not going to win this. Okay, we're running into, like... We're running into the wall. We, we drew too many games early that we, we should have won. But I've had a, a great time. Have you had a great time? I hope so. Otherwise, why are you watching this? Go do something with your life. What are you doing here? What am I doing here? I'm here because you're here. Please, please stop. You've buffed the same unit so many times. Like the classic Price is Right video, Joy, you've used the one twice. You've buffed. The, the duckling is, is too buffed. You've gone too far, okay? It doesn't have to be a cell trigger. It could just be a great unit. I'm going to go for the cell trigger. Because <laughs> I'm... <laughs> what can I say? I like to put a little panache into it. It's a level 2 turtle. Oh, well, that's no good. Okay, it turns out Mosquito's not going to benefit me. It turns out um, I'm dead. But I meant that. When I said it, I meant it. I had a great time. I hope you did as well. And I'm telling you, I think that the trick with the starfish is we should have gotten rid of it earlier. Like maybe three rounds ago, if we get rid of the starfish, we start running like a stegosaurus or something instead. If I thought about it, but I was just like, I danced with the one that brought me. It's like the sharks trying to win a Stanley Cup with Joe Thorne, you know? You traded Marco Stern for him 15 years ago. You got to give him another shot. I know he's on the Panthers now. Anyway, long story short, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. It helps it a great deal. Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. For now, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya.